All right, Shalom, Shalom. We are the real Hebrew Israelites coming day in and day out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon the Great, which is America. All right. First off and foremost, call Halloyim Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai by Shem Karkadash. Barakatham to the elect that's out there. Double honors to the other apostles, a great millstone. And once again, salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. Um, I'm going to hop straight into it, man. Like it's um, without a shadow of a doubt that we know the RFID chip is the mark of the beast. Same with Babylon the Great. Without a shadow of a, of a doubt, we know that Mystery Babylon the Great is America, man. Simply put, man. All right, and, and the scriptures let us know spiritually what the hell this place is talking about. Who this place is talking about. All right? And, and let's get the evidence. Let's get the historical facts, if you will. All right? This is Revelation 17, 5 and 6. And it reads, And upon her forehead was a name written, Mystery Babylon the Great, the mother of harlots, the abomination of the whole earth. Okay? This is not talking about the Vatican. You can't say, well, because all world religions come out of the Vatican. Before the Vatican ever uh, existed, you had different fucking religions already, man. All right? So the Vatican is not the mother of all harlots, man. All right? The mother of all harlots is this fucking place known as America, man. And, and, and its fucking way of life, which is really a way of death, because this place is called the shadow of death. The way of death... All right, it, it is what it promotes to all the other nations, to all the other people on this earth. Okay, it says, and I saw the woman drunken with the blood of the saints and with the blood of the martyrs of Yahweh Shai. And when I saw her, I wondered with great ammunition. Now, this ain't the Vatican because the prophets didn't die over there in the Vatican. All right, the prophets did not die over there in the Vatican. So, this is talking about a place. Okay, it says she was drunken with the blood of the saints. Now you should know who the the, the saints are, man. All right, which are you Israelites, man? Okay. And when did uh, this uh, uh, this woman, all right, which is America, all right, where she sits on the beast, which represents in, in totality. All right, the EU, the nation, uh, uh, the EU and, um, damn, what is it? The EU and, and NATO, all right, was really, is in the image of the uh, ancient Roman Empire, man. All right, that's how it's set up, okay? And who's controlling the beast? Who's riding it? America, all right? That's why Trump is doing what the fuck he, he wants to do. And ultimately, who controls them? Who controls the puppets, the, uh, the puppets? All right, the Rothschilds, the Rockef uh, Rockefeller, the t uh, the Rockefellers, the Oppenheimers, the uh, the top elite, man. Okay, which is a part of the goddamn beast too, man. Okay, so it's all hand in hand with each other, man. Okay, so my question is, when did this woman have a chance to to, to be drunken with the blood of Israel uh, of all the Israelites at once? All right, when the same place. Northern kingdom and the southern kingdom were oppressed together. All right. Matter of fact, let's read Revelations 18 and 23. It says, In the light of a candle shall shine no more in thee, and the voice of the bridegroom and of the bride shall no more be heard in thee. All right. Because everything is going to be put to dust over here in America, man. All right. The wisdom is going to be put out. All right. Just like uh, Job talks about the light of the wicked being put out. All right. There's going to be no more marriages. No, no, it's going to be no mirth in this land, man. Okay? It says this. All right? For thy merchants were the great men of the earth. All right? Because <laughs> who do all the other nations vastly trade with? America, the U.S. petrodollar. This is what the world revolves around, man. Okay? That's why when uh, Trump makes the tariffs, it fucks up the uh, the economical system, man. Okay? And everybody starts to fucking lose their hair. Okay? Nonetheless, it says, And by thy sorcer sorceries 
were all nations uh, deceived. Thy witchcraft, thy uh, 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 that pen and paper, man. All right, that 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 uh, that slithering, that snake-like tongue. All right. In her, okay, and and America has deceived all you dumbass nations with that goddamn dollar, with that uh, um, uh, that Babylon juice, democracy. Okay. Now back to this revelations. It says in her were found the blood of the prophets. All right. And of the saints. So not only the prophets of the saints, the rest of Israel, man, and all that were slain upon the earth. Now let's break that down. Okay. Where was the vast majority? And yes, we know we've been scattered all across the earth. Where was the vast majority of the Israelites slaughtered at? Over here on this side. All right. Started in the early 1400s. All right, Christopher Colon came over to the West Indies, South America, so on and so forth. All right, and that thus begun the the uh, the slaughter of the Northern Kingdom. All right, the genocide of the Northern Kingdom. All right, and the genocide of the uh, Southern Kingdom, man. All right, the same place they were oppressed together, which is Babylon the Great, man. All right, when did that fully happen? Over here, okay? Not no damn Vatican. All right. Hey, it didn't happen in the room. Hey, it didn't happen in the room. All right? Because the vast majority of the Northern Kingdom, once again, disclaimer, you assholes, we know the 12 tribes are scattered abroad. The vast majority of the Northern Kingdom was on the other side of the earth. So guess what? Esau didn't have a full grip uh, on the house of Israel, all right, when he was in rulership as the Romans, nor the Greeks. So when, did he, when was this woman, all right, drunken with the blood of the saints, all right? Over here in the Americas. Okay? And then it proceeds to say, and all that were slain upon the earth. Is not this man blessing the sword? Okay? Is it not? Who runs Mystery Babylon? Esau Edom. Who runs the dragon? Esau Edom. It's the same motherfucker starting with the elites. And you niggas want to tap dance. All right. Let's find out who the saints is, man. I just say you niggas want to be old oh, history, history. All right, so when did Esau get a full grip on the nation of Israel? A full motherfucking grip. And I'm going to say it like uh, Samuel L. Jackson, man. All right. All right, because now it's time to get funky, man. We ain't holding our tongues for none of you wicked ass prophets, man. You guys are going off. Plain and simple. And you're going to be rebuked sharply before all. And the Lord is going to make manifest your folly. The Lord is going to judge you in front of everybody, man. Okay? <laughs> Through. <laughs> all right? Let's find out who the saints are, man. Praise. Uh, this is Psalms 149, 1 and 2. All right? Praise ye Yahweh. Sing ye unto Yahweh a new song. And his praise in the congregation of his saints. Now, what's that new song? This this doctrine is spree, uh, speaking now, man. This wine. All right. Let Israel rejoice in him that made him. Let the children of Zion be joyful in their king. So it tells you that the saints are obviously the Israelites. Starting with the elect. All right. So when did this bitch Babylon, when was she drunken with the blood of the saints? Ha. Only could be when the northern kingdom and southern kingdom were oppressed together. All right? Because for that to happen, how did Obadiah 1 and 10 happen? All right? For thy violence against thy brother Jacob. Jacob is all 12 tribes, nigga. All right? Not the southern kingdom only, not the northern kingdom only. All right? When did Esau fully put that violence on Jacob? Over here in the Americas. All right? Shame should cover thee. Thou should be cut off forever. And that's where Esau is headed. Amos 1 and 11. Thus saith Yahweh, for three transgressions of Edom and for four, I would not turn away the punishment thereof. Because he did pursue his brother with the sword once again and did cast off all pity and anger and did tear perpetually. All right, do you know how long perpetually is? All right. And kept his wrath forever, a long time. And when did Esau fully do that upon all the nation? Yes, once again, I know we were scattered, you motherfucker. But there's a great salvation coming from somewhere, and there's going to be a great destruction 
somewhere. Babylon the Great, the lands in the north. Okay? If you niggas don't want under uh if you niggas don't want to understand that, so fucking what, nigga? Die. We don't care. This is for the elect so they can get edified. Okay? Because deep down inside, you hey, you false prophets are cut, man. Ain't no way of getting around these scriptures. Alright? Like you niggas want to prophesy with your, uh, your your heads covered, but the priests clearly had a mercury and they poured oil, right? Right? Uh uh the little circular part that was open for their crown. Alright? Yeah, you niggas are going off, man. Same niggas that say they don't know who the 12 tribes are, but the nigga know who the fuck a uh, Dan is, man. And you guys still believe in that shit. But you guys don't know who the 12 man. Sh get out of here, man. It's evident that you guys are full of folly, man. And your, hey, your fruit is shown. Alright? Alright, Jeremiah 50 and 33. Thus saith Yahweh of hosts, the children of Israel, northern kingdom, and the children of Judah, southern kingdom, were oppressed together. When did that happen? The vast majority of the northern kingdom left after the Syrian captivity. You niggas, although you try to beat around that part, y'all try to come up with all these uh, other ways to bend the scriptures and say, well, they were here. Well, there was, listen, we know there were uh, 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 Israelites of all the tri tribes still scattered abroad. You can find that out in the gospel. But the vocal point of them was over here, man. And this is what this is talking about. And all that took them kept them captive, held them fast, and refused to let them go. All right? So, hey, not only were we oppressed uh, uh, over here together, all right, and that's for the vast mo uh, vocal point, all right, all the 12 tribes are, are, are oppressed all across the world, man, all right, because the curses. Revelations 12 and 4, and 4, and his tail drew a third part of the stars of heaven, all right, his tail being the dragon, the Romans, all right, which, hey, the, uh, uh, what happened? Herod, right, which was set up by the Romans, which Herod was part of this damn dragon. He's an Edomite, simply put, man. And you niggas try to beat around that. You niggas try to scuff everything, man. But you can't, right? And it says, did cast them to the earth. And the dragon stood before the woman, the woman being Israel, and was and when she was ready to be delivered to devour her child as soon as she was born. And you, you can find this prophecy in the Old Testament, man, of Rachel weeping, okay? Because that child was Yahweh Shai, man. And hey, who's the three stars? The southern kingdom. All right? So the Roman Empire was oppressing them. But guess what? Where was the other stars at? For the uh, most part, they was on the other side of the earth. Guess what? The Roman Empire wasn't oppressing them. So when did this bitch, Babylon the Great, when did she oppress the uh, both kingdoms together and was drunken with her blood? Over here in the lands of the north. North America, South America, all right? Damn. All right? Because where, where, where did those two sticks primarily come together at, man? Over here in the Americas, man. Jeremiah 3 and 18. And in those days, the house of Judah, southern kingdom, shall walk with the house of Israel, northern kingdom, and they shall come together out of the land of the north to, so we're going to come from the land of the north to the land which I have give, given thee for inheritance unto your father, which is uh, uh, Israel, man. How are we going to walk together? All right? Matter of fact, it's it. Hold on. Let me see if I could grab a Bible shot. So like it. Come, right? It says they was going to walk out of the land of the north uh, together, right? I believe, was it? Verse 19. So like it. 
Right, because when you read verse 19, it says, I mean, no, when you read verse 17, it says, and at that time shall I call Jerusalem the throne of Yahweh, and all nations should be gathered into it, in the name of the Lord, into the name of the Lord, to Jerusalem, neither should they walk anymore at the, at the uh, after uh, the in, uh, imagination of their wicked heart, man. So, like I was saying, what time period, when did Judah and Israel walk together? When are they going to come out of this land in the north together? All right, it's about to happen very soon, over here in the lands of the north, man. All right? Okay? It's Jeremiah 16 and 14. Behold, and therefore, behold, the days come, saith Yahweh. All right? There should no more be said, Yahweh liveth, that brought it the children of Israel out of the land of Egypt. But Yahweh liveth that brought the children of Israel out of the lands of the north. Babylon the great. All right. The new Passover, man. All right. It's going to be a great salvation. All right. So where is it going to be? So where is the great destruction going to be? The same exact place. All right. This place got to get punished for the, uh, the slavery it has done to us and all the atrocities, man. And not only that, the things it promotes as far as the uh, the wickedness Babylon the Great promote. That's why it's going to be uh, destroyed like Sodom and Gomorrah. And ancient Babylon was not destroyed in that fashion, you dummy. I can't believe you niggas around, uh, around this asshole actually listen to that and don't put one and two together. It's because your ass twice a child of hell, man. And you niggas are stupid as hell. All right? Shit don't even make sense. But you guys uh so against the spirit of your how about Shimmy I was shy. That's what it is. Alright, and it says, and from all the lands where I have driven them, and I will bring them again into the land uh until their fathers. Alright? Like I said, yes, all Israel was scattered abroad. We know that, you jackass. Y'all can't tap that uh y'all can't tap dance around this, man. Y'all just talk shit. Bend scriptures the opposite way and whatever. All right? That shit can fall on deaf ears, man. All right? This is only for the elect because the elect the only people that's going to understand it. All right? Revelations 18 and 4. And I heard a voice from heaven saying, come out of her, my people. Be not partakers of her sin and receive not her plagues. What's going to be the plague of Babylon the Great? Fire. How the hell is the people going to come up out of her? Uh, uh, that trumpet, that great voice. All right, that, uh, that, 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 that mighty shout. All right, the elect getting beamed up. Where is that going to happen? Babylon the Great, America, not no goddamn Vatican. We all ain't over there in the goddamn Vatican, you dumbass. You stupid son of a bitch. All right. All praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakar Kadash. All right? Double honors to the other apostles, a great millstone, salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. All right? And death to you, false prophets, man. All right? The Lord got a, a special death for you guys, man. All right? Shalom.